we can see here that SPSS has reported a correlation matrix. The matrix is mirrored on the diagonal, so we only need to look at the left or the top right corner. SPSS first reports the correlation coefficient. We denote this with an italicized lowercase r with an s subscript. This is interpreted in the same way as Pearson's r, with values ranging from negative 1 to 1. Below this, SPSS reports the significance level, or p-value, for the correlation. And finally, SPSS reports the sample size for the correlation. As only one Spearman's row was performed, the results could be presented in a statistical sentence, such as Spearman's row identified a significant relationship between the highest level of education and annual income. You would then report the correlation coefficient and p-value. When performing multiple correlations, it is more appropriate to present the results in a table.